everybody, my name is Harry. Welcome back to the channel. Today is a brand new video for 25 Days of Harry, and as you can tell, we have the <laughs> funny background up once again, and I just realized I forgot to move the mouse. There we go. And yeah, so we have the funny background up, and today we are going to be looking at some hockey cards. Yes, the desk is here. These are piled up to here. We have a ton of uh, hockey card packs that I have uh, pre-opened. I already opened them from up to four or five years ago, and, uh, yeah, I forget what's in a majority of these, um, so I figured, why not, let's open them again, you've probably seen them in the background of a couple video of a majority of my videos, my content from the past, uh, handful of years, so I figured again, hey, why not, let's, uh, let's go through these packs again, let's see what's in them, uh, I doubt this is gonna be split up into two parts, I really hope it isn't, so without further ado, we're going to get into it. I guess what I'll do is I'll introduce the packs, and then I will, um, yeah, I guess I'll open them like that. So I think, yeah, the, by the way, there's no, like, real structure to this video. I don't even know how I'm going to do this. But, yeah, so we've got, um, we've got three packs of 1990 uh, score here. There's two of them that are a little different, so... Don't know if that means we're getting different cards, but uh, yeah. So we got some 1990 score. We've got two packs of 1991 score. I'm trying to fit this in, into the in the camera, by the way. We've got two packs of Opichi Premier 92. Give me a second. I'm actually gonna turn on my uh, my light one sec, real quick. All right, I've got the uh, I've got my ring light on now. I'm hoping this actually looks a little bit better, makes it a little bit brighter. We've got two packs of NHL Pro Set 1991-92. These were not 30 uh, 29 cents each. These were technically like three dollars because I got them in a surprise bag. But either way, those are going to be fun to open. Those are some of the most recent packs I've gotten too. Actually, we've got two packs of 1991-92 NHL Pro Set Series Two. So that's fun. We've got one pack of 91 92 series two uh pro set. So I don't know what's the difference between that and the other set, but there apparently is. Uh, and then we've got approximately 15 packs of upper deck choice Swedish hockey 1998 99. We've got one, two, three, uh, four because these two are, are stuck to each other. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen packs of this shit to open. So that's gonna be fun. Uh, and then for more modern packs, we've got uh, one 2004 Quest for the Cup with the Canucks and Leafs on there. Oh Nolan and Brendan Morrison, non-respectively, because I named them out of order. Uh, we've got three packs of 0607 uh, Heroes and Prospects. I used to have more packs of this, but uh, we lost those, unfortunately. Uh, we've got... Oh, this is pretty cool. we got three packs of 0910 Opichi. Uh, I don't think I've... Uh, I remember opening these. I don't remember what's in those, if anything. We've got one... Uh, I believe this is 1112 score, I think. Uh... I'm trying to find, like, a copyright date. I'm assuming... Uh, actually, this might be 10-11, then. Uh, yeah, it's not saying where it is. All it's saying is that it's Marty Brodeur. So, I'm going to assume 10-11 score. We got a pack of 19-20 MVP. 21-22 uh, Opichi. Uh, okay, and then here we get into some, like, big boy packs. We've got uh, four packs of 21-22... Upper Deck Series 1. These are all kind of thick, so we'll see if we get anything in those. I actually forget, funny enough. Uh, then we've got, I believe, six packs of Series 2 for 21, 22, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We actually have seven packs of this stuff, so yeah, we've got seven packs of those. And then we've got one, two, three. We've got four packs of Series 1. You can tell which ones are big, which ones are thick. The uh, thin, Which ones are thick and which ones are thin. The thinner ones we've got from the dollar store, but these ones, uh, you can tell which ones have eight cards and which have eight and four. Um, yeah, because I used to get a lot of these from my sister. Not used to. I, I still get a decent bit of them from my sisters. But, yeah, then we got some 22, 23 Series 2. We've got one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten packs of that stuff. So, yeah, we'll open those uh, probably last. We'll see. And then I just realized I don't have enough space to 
uh, to open the cards right now without having to just like squish in there. So I'm going to pause real quick. I'm going to reorganize uh, these and then we will get into the actual card opening uh, five minutes in. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. I cleaned up a little bit. We've now moved some of the cards. We see a stack here. And actually, I just realized what I could then do is take the second stack and put it there. It's just off camera, but you can, there you go. You get a little couple, couple peaks there. Uh, so yeah, we're going to start obviously with the 1990 score packs. We'll work our way up. We'll end with the 22-23 series two packs. So we're 1990 score again. I can play for actually. I can hold. I can hold it like this. So that's cool. So firstly, we've got Dave Ellett, uh, Rick Tockett, the current head coach of the Canucks, I believe. We've got Adam Oates, Mark Messier, uh, Jamie Leach, prospect. That's fun. Daryl Sador, first round pick of the Kings. Few. Holy shit! This is this is cool. Future superstar. Eric Lindros. I don't know if this is worth anything, but that is a fucking cool card. Future superstar Eric Lindros. Paul Coffey, speedster. Troy Millette. Or Troy Mallet. I think it's Troy Millette. Trent Yanni. Pele Eklund. Patrick Waugh with the Montreal Canadiens. 1990 All-Star. Uh, first team, by the way. Uh, Rod Brindamore. Paul Gillies. Neil Broughton. Oh, that's our last card. All right, so yeah, so straight up off the bat, uh, that Daryl Sador is kind of cool, but this Eric Lindros, if that's worth anything more than like five bucks, that's gonna be, that's gonna be really cool. I might keep these ones actually, by the way, these 1990 score uh, uh, card opener, I guess card uh, like little flyers. I don't even know what the fuck they're called. I'm kind of stupid in case you guys haven't been able to tell. Um, yeah, I might keep these because all of these are different, so. Yeah, so we got 15 cards in these, by the way, so this is going to be fun. So, 1990 score, we've got Darren Poopa. This is our second box, by the way. Our second box, but our second uh, thing. Dave Ellett, once again. Rick Tockett again. <laughs> Adam O.G., I wonder if we're getting a Daryl Sador. Oh, Shannon Tosky. Shannon Tonsky. Mark Gregg, first round pick. Steve Eiserman, magician. Scott Stevens. Uh, Banger, which, not really. Uh, Brian Leach. That was weird. The first, like, three cards were all the same. Uh, Craig Adams. Gordy Roberts. Larry Ro That is fucking... That is cursed. Larry Robinson on the LA Kings. That is a cursed card right there. Uh, Jeff Norton. Uh, Peter Sirico. And Curtis Joseph. So, there's that. And Approve... That I'm not keeping these packs any longer. Boom. There we go, boys. So, God, that hurts me. But you know what? It's it's time to move on from the packs. Any further packs we get. We'll probably do this every like four or five years, depending on how many packs we get. I'll start stacking up new packs in the background. So, yeah. Uh, you guys will know this one when this was recorded, by the way, because the next Hab stream will probably have no packs. So, yeah. Oh, wait. Why am I doing it like that? Okay. So, 1990 score. We've got... Mike Lawler, or Mike Lawler, I'm pretty sure it's Mike Lawler, uh, yeah, Mike, uh, Jimmy Carson, Jimmy Carson, before he was ruined by the Oilers, let's go, Bobby Smith, absolute Habs legend, Sergey Makarov wins the Calder at, like, what was it, 33 years old, 34 years old, something like that, uh, Stan Schmiel with Extra Islander in the back, Jim, uh, Jim Hrivnak, NHL prospect, Adrian Plafsik, NHL prospect. Scott Arnell, that's fun. Brian Prop, Marty McSorley, Gretzky's right hand man. Clinton Malarchuk, that is a cursed card. Craig Janney, Kelly Hurdy, Michael Modano, Mike Modano, and Bob Asenza. So there's all of our packs for 1990 score. Uh, actually, I just realized what I should do is I should probably keep, I should do like what the, the rest of the hockey card YouTubers do, put like any po actual polls aside. So I think I'm going to do that real quick. I'm going to go through these real quick and I'm fine. Any polls. I'll be right back in a second. <laughs> All right, we're back. I've pulled out a couple of the cards, mostly just the, the rookie cards so far and the Eric Lindros, of course. Um, yeah, those are the only ones that I've uh, pulled so far. So yeah, that's the last of the NHL 1990 score packs, by the way. Big shout out, they actually have the Habs logo on there. 
Uh, yeah. And now we move on to both of the 1990 packs. We can apparently get a special consumer offer and win special Bobby Orr cards. Let's see if we do that here, boys. So 1991 score. Oh, I forgot how different these looked. We've got a Kevin Todd top prospect. I don't know if this would count as a pull. Kip Miller. Uh, Kip Miller either. But we've got him. Uh, Doug Wilson, you know what, yeah, fuck it, why not, we'll probably not have many polls, so I'll we'll count them, we've got Dougie Wilson, Patrick Waugh, that's a sick card right there, that's really cool, Wayne Gretzky, so, we're getting some Gretzkys, uh, we're getting at least one, John Cullen, the franchise, I guess that could count as a poll, the Jennings Trophy, Ed Belfort, actually, you know what, no, I'm not counting the franchise as a poll, <laughs> uh, Mark Hunter, I love making these rules up as I go along. John Tonelli, that's what makes me unique, boys. Uh, Bob Basson, Pelly Eklund, Tony McKegney, Eric Desjardins, Keith Acton, Don Sweeney. So those are the cards for 1991 score. And yes, I will put them on top of the 91 of the 1990 score because why wouldn't I be annoying? So score 91. And now we've got win special Bobby Orr cards. Let's see if we can do that. So we've got Doug Wilson with a little green stripe on the side. Uh, Joe Sackick. Oh, by the way, Doug Wilson will probably actually be on the uh, on the Sharks at this point, actually, because he was probably taking the expansion draft. Russ Cortnell, Bill Ranford, Vincent Riondo, Murray Barron. I don't know why they have these green stripes. I don't know if these green stripes mean these are the cards that can win you Bobby Orr or what, but yeah. Uh, Peter Sirico, Ally Afraidy, Doug Lidster. Oh, that's fucking cool. 1991 Stanley Cup champion, Pittsburgh Penguins. That's a really sick card. That's really cool. I'm putting that... Yeah, why not? I'm putting that in the polls. That's something kind of rare. Dale Hunter, so we got Mark and then we got Dale. Shane Corson, Dan Quinn, Peter Ng, Peter Ng. And Terry Karkner is your last card for 1991 score. So there we go. We've got that pack emptied. Now we're going to move on to the... I'm actually going to move the poles, actually. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, I'm going to move the poles into the little pile you can kind of see on screen. Now we're going to move on to the two packs of OPG Premier 92. So I forgot about these cards. Oh, okay. They look like this. Not my favorite look. Not a really good look. But you know what? Hey, whatever. So we got Steve Smith... Luke Richardson, Vinny Dalfus, Habs legend, Adam Crankton, Tom Curvers, rest in peace, Tim Kerr, Steve Duchesne, uh, Montreal Canadiens is your last card, Patrick Wall, of course, on the front, that's pretty cool, so there we go, we got another uh, one there, we got another pack, uh, that's like, what, three Patrick Walls, by the way, now, uh, we've got Kevin Stevens, Kirk McLean. Another Montreal Canadiens, this one, I believe is Matthew Schneider? I believe Matthew Schneider? Yes, it is. It is indeed Matthew Schneider on the front of that card. Another Adam Oates. Nicholas Lidstrom, have his rookie card. If you've seen the uh, hockey card collection video, you will know about that. Jeff Cortnell, Thomas Furland, and Gary Roberts are the cards that we get in those in that pack, so... We've got the two Opeachy Platinums. Uh, Premier's done already. Let's get into the NHL Pro Sets. These are $0.29 cents each. Let's see if we can get $0.29 cents out of val uh, for value out of these. So, okay, there we go. So firstly, we've got Russ Cortnell. I can tell these are going to be kind of hard to see because of the glare. Sean Burke. Mikhail Pavanka. Patrick Flatley. Mike Keane. Brian Leach All-Star, Sean Burr, Darren Turcott, UA Krupp, Benoit Hogue, John McClain, Dale Howarchuk, uh, Brian Mullen, now with San Jose, that's cool, Ken Hodge, I believe that's Junior, and Rob Zettler, so this is another Shark card, I believe that's before they changed the logo to the... Um, more recognizable straight triangle, as I call it. That's one pack down. Let's get into the second for the pro sets. We've got Bob Kadelski, Mike Ridley, Steve Duchesne, Gary Lehman, 
Todd Ellick, Gary Sutter, Rick Zombo, Joel Otto, Brian Scrudland, Denny Savard, that's sick, Tony Granado, Alexander McGilney, I believe this is the year he scored 70, uh, 91, 92, that genuinely might be from the year he scored 70 goals, um, Stephen Leach, Thomas Steen, and uh, it might be Andy Moak, Dirk Graham for the Frank J. Selkie, so that's pretty cool, uh, another 15 cards down, I'd say we probably got about 20 cents of value, so packs, uh, jury's still out on if they're worth their value. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now we've got two packs, well, technically three packs of 91, 92, Series 2. I have no clue what the third pack has that, the two, that these two don't. Uh, well, let's just see. First, see what they look Oh, God, it's these. Oh, these are going to be a bitch to see on camera. Okay, never mind. There we go. We're, we're, getting, we're getting somewhere. So we got, uh, firstly, Brian Trottier uh, on the front or on the back of that one. Uh, Brian Bradley, maybe? Holy shit, that actually is Brian Bradley. Of course, Doug Gilmore, there's only 193 in Toronto. Uh, 33, that's not Chara, because I think he wore three in, in the with the Islanders. Would oh, that be Patrick Flatley again? That's not Patrick Flatley. Benoit Hogue. Okay, Benoit Hogue. Uh, prospect, that's not Nigel Dawes. That's Stu Barnes. Is that a Stu Barnes prospect? Holy shit, it is. Uh, why not? I'll count that as a, pl as a poll. We haven't gotten one of those in a while. Uh, Red Wings, I have no clue. <laughs> Uh, Brad McCrimmon, Brad McCrimmon, that would not be Trevor Linden, because it is Yarke Lume, uh, I don't know, actually, I don't know a lot of players that are in this set, Claude, uh, Vilgrain, Claude Vilgrain, maybe, I don't know, uh, oh, sorry, sorry, I'm trying to show these off on camera properly, I would not have a damn clue, but that is Dan Quinn, thank you, oh, and then we got some prospect cards, so this one I have no clue, is Kevin Todd. Of course, we'll count these. Why not? Is Oh, performance. Uh, Brett Hall card. I thought that said... Oh, that's fucking cool. James Belushi for the Hawks. You know, I'll count that as a poll. Why not? Anytime you get a celebrity card, that's always kind of fun. Uh, next set for... Uh, next pro set set. Um, oh, prospect. Who is that? That is Doug Waite. You know what? Doug Waite. Recog I, I recognize that name. That's pretty all right. Uh, Adam Graves. Adam Graves, we've got a Brian Benning next up. Uh, oh, another prospect card. That's not Eric Desjardins because he started his career with the Canadians. That is Corey Foster. Uh, not to be confused with Scott Foster, who is the Hawks, that Hawks goalie for the one game. Uh, Callie Johansson. Oh, God. Okay, this is going to fall right down. Uh, I would not have a clue. I am very face blind when it comes to Canadians, uh, when it comes to players from the 90s. That's Cliff Ronning. Prospect, I would have no clue for the Blues. That is Nelson Emerson. Uh, Merv Albert, I'm going to count that. I don't, I'm don't. i pretty sure he's just like the play-by-play -play guy for the Rangers. But um, Dimitri Kristich, that's fun. Uh, Gaetan Boucher for the Nordiques, that's in the burn pile. Uh, <laughs> no. Uh, Craig Billington for the Jersey Devils, premier performer. Oh, fuck, that's cool. That is cool. Ralph Macchio for the Islanders. That is in his My Cousin Vinny phase. This might have actually been like right after. Yeah, The Outsiders, Karate Kid. Yeah, recently appeared in the movie My Cousin Vinny. Holy shit. Yep, so that that's definitely going in the that's definitely going in the burn pile. <laughs> no. Fucking love My Cousin Vinny. That's a great movie. Uh alright, the third pro set uh set of cards. We've got another 50. Oh! Oh, shit, no, I joined the official NHL Rank Rat Fan Club. Join the Rat Pack today and be a part of terrific merchandise offers, Rink Rat Club Kit merchandise, and team updates. Rink Rats also have an opportunity to be a part of nationwide Rat Pack events and are eligible to win a trip to an opening night game. Sign up today. Ten cents off <laughs> NHL licensed merchandise. Definitely the hottest discounts. So, yeah, that's that's kind of that's kind of cool. Oh, okay, thank God. Okay, we're back to these now. So we've got uh, Herb Raglan, John Tonelli, Rob Ramage. I have no clue he was on the stars. Rob Ray, that's a fun card. Shout out uh, Chev Camaro. David Malley, Iwe Krupp, Benoit Hogue, Steve Casper, Kelly Buckberger. Oh, there we go. K 
Captain Mario Lemieux. That's a sick one. Uh, play smart. No, I'm pretty sure that's uh, Alan May. No clue who that is. Uh, rookie Corey Foster. I'll count that. Captain Guy Carbono. That is a sick card right there, boys. Uh, Mark Habsheard. And rookie Nelson Emerson. So, uh, the, uh, the, the pull pile is uh, getting fairly thick. So, that's pretty good. So, yeah. We've got uh, some more cards down. And with that now, we move on to this stack. Which means <laughs> we're opening about 15 packs of Swedish hockey. We got six hockey cards per pack. Let's stop fucking dicking around. I'm going to move... The first stack there, I'm actually going to move the pulls here, and we'll put all the Swedish cards here. So, first pack of Swedish Hockey League cards. Uh, I really hope I can say some of these names. Uh, the top two, I believe, are going to be the most recent. I believe it's going from most recent to the uh, the oldest that we've had. So, Bjorn Nord. Let's hope there's at least one player I recognize here. Uh, Roger Akerstrom. Kim Janssen. I don't know if that's the Kim Janssen that made the NHL, but... That's a fun one. Johan uh, Silverplatz. Sign of the Times, Tord Lindstrom. I'm going to put those aside. Oh, shit. I forgot I got this. Trade cards. This is pretty cool. So, uh, congr dear dear co collector, congratulations. You have received a, tr a trade card redeemable for the complete 10 card A Day in the Life insert set. To receive your complete set of A Day in the Life. To, to receive your complete set of a day in the life, uh, please send this card to... Oh, shit. And then the uh, the upper deck address, which I don't think that's a dox. They put it on the card themselves. Please allow for four to six weeks for delivery of your complete set of a day in the life cards. Offer expires twelve thirty one ninety nine. I wonder what happens if I send this to upper deck right now. <laughs> uh, I would try that, but I don't want to lose the trade card because I actually think that's really, really cool. So, yeah. Uh, next up for a next pack of Swedish hockey. By the way, if you guys are wondering, Harry, how the hell did you find Swedish hockey card packs? Uh, surprisingly, they were on, uh, they were in dollar store surprise bags. And they still are, because I just got the, these last two, like, uh, three, not three months ago. Like, three fucking three weeks ago. Alexander's, uh, Bel, Belgiv, Belgivskis, Matt's Lung, Lust, uh, Pekka Pentinen, uh, it, to any people who might be from Sweden or around that area who know how to pronounce these names, I apologize. Jan Hamar, Mikael Pedersen, Sound of the Times, Ronald Pedersen. Oh, and Ronald Pedersen. Okay, there, there we go. That was the last one. So, yeah. So, we've got oh, some decent polls uh, so far. None of them from Swedish hockey, really. Uh, the trade card was kind of cool, actually. Stefan Omen. Oh. Whatever that is, that's going in the pool section. Uh, David Petreski, <laughs> Anders Gozi, or Gozi, Hans Loden, World Junior Showcase Magnus Nielsen, and Sign of the Times Ulf Stenner. So, yeah, we're going to watch this pile slowly rise up, boys. Oh, can I open this one? There's no way I did not open this pack. Do we have, like, a first? Holy shit. Oh, no. Unless I... Oh, no, because it's got sticky stuff on it. Okay, so this one has been opened before. All right, this one has been opened before. False alarm, boys. Thomas Johansson. I believe I put him in HHSL 2.0. Roger Johansson. Anders Carlson, I believe, played 90 games in the NHL. Uh, Klaas Eriksson. Matthias Luf. I don't know if he's related to Leo Loof. And a checklist for cards 119 to 177, who is uh, Daniel Sedin. They also have uh, uh, Frantislav, uh, Frantislav Caberle, Kim Janssen, who I, I believe I already have. And, uh, yeah, a couple of notable NHL names, so that's kind of cool. By the way, you can get, apparently, um, Henrik and Daniel Sedin jersey cards. So, yeah, I've been holding out hope, but I believe the poll on that, I don't know if it says on the back... Um, yeah, the jersey cards are 1 in 4,000. You guys can't see it, but 1 in 4,000 packs. So, yeah, the chances of us getting that are about less likely than me hitting a million subscribers. So, yeah. Oh, there we go. Furnace Love Caverly. Speaking of, let's go. 
uh, Lars Edstrom, uh, Peter Ronquist, Mikkel Magnuson, Paul Anderson Everberg, and Sign of the Times, Lennart Svedberg. So, that's fun, I guess. <laughs> Alright, uh, next up, we've got uh, Bjorn Nord again, Roger Akerstrom, Frederick Krakula, Stefan Lind uh, Lundqvist, I believe he played a couple games, brother of Henrik, I believe. World Junior Showcase, Johan Forsander, Forsander, and A Day in the Life of Marcus uh, Thurison. So uh, that's already kind of a jip from uh, the trade card because I already got one, at least, of the Day in the Lifes. I don't know if I have any more uh, of the Beatles, but we'll see. Johan Finstrom, Daniel Reidmark, Mikael Lindman, Mikael Lindstrom, Lindholm, sorry, R2 Blomstam and Sign of the Times at Roland Stoltz. So that's fun. I wish Sign of the Times meant like they signed the card, but then you'd have to have like zero inserts. Um, Johan Holmquist, I believe he played NHL games. Uh, Hans Janssen, Peter Strom, Magnus Thornson, Sign of the Times, Lars Bjorn, and Samuel Poulsen. He played NHL games. Bruins. I want to say he was on the Ducks and the Oilers as well, I think. I'm not too sure, though, but I believe he was. Uh, all right, the next pack up, we've got... Uh, oh, shit. Okay, what a fucking first card. Daniel Sedin. That's probably worth about a dollar. <laughs> Just because these were probably so massively produced. Patrick Erickson. Kim Janssen once again. Johan Silverplatz. Mikael Pedersen. And Sound of the Times... Roland Pedersen again, so... Yeah, there we go. So, that's pretty cool. Daniel Sedin, I don't know... I don't think I got Henrik in one of these before. Yeah, I see another one of these that's uh, sort of acting up. I gotta kind of open it again. There we go. Sorry, I'm just gonna close it up. There we go. Alright, we've got Teppo Kivilla, Anders Soderberg, Dick Tarnstrom. He was an NHLer. Yarko Vervio, Pierre Hadin, the third Sedin brother, of course, and a checklist from cards 178 to uh, Game Jersey A1, which is Daniel and Henrik Sedin. I'm assuming both of those are the Jersey cards, so yeah, uh, they've got a decent, they actually have two Daniel and Henrik cards on here. I wonder which one this Daniel is. That is 177, so I don't know if there's like what the different version is, but yeah, we've got two of the checklists now so that's pretty fun next up and by the way after this after this one i think i'm gonna pause the video real quick and just do a second one in case anyone calls me i don't want my phone to suddenly stop recording and me have to redo this video all from scratch so we've got jans nielsen peter nylander i'm trying to get the card there we go marco tulula stefan helquist a Day in the Life of Yarmo Niles, and A Day in the Life of Johan Hedberg. So, former NHL goaltender, former Atlanta Thrasher. That's pretty cool. We've got three of those now. So, uh, I'm just going to stop the recording. I'll be back in just two seconds, but it'll seem like nothing to you guys. All right. Uh, I'm back. We just pulled the two Day in the Lifes in one. So, that's fun. You guys are seeing my collection of, of fucking Swedish hockey cards growing by the minutes by the way if we if we get both hen if we get both daniel and henrik in these in the in this set i will start collecting the rest of the cards except the jerseys because those are probably worth like 50 dollars and i don't want to shell that kind of money out lars goron wilklander or wicklander uh magnus svensson henrik nielsen matthias johansson oh Samuel Poulsen again, so that's probably an extra I could sell for like 30 cents. And uh, Sign of the Times, Tord Lindstrom. So, that's fun. We got a Tord Lindstrom there. Lind Lundstrom, sorry. Uh, one of the last, I think is, yeah, yeah, we're down to the last three packs. So, we're getting through, boys. Jesper Damquin, Damcard. Jesper Damcard. Anders Marveled. Christian uh, Lechteller. Anders Huss, uh, World Championship Showcase, Pierre Hadin, 
And Mikel Pedersen, so surprisingly, no sign of the times in that one. Uh, Alright, last two packs, and then we're on to the more uh, modern-day packs, boyos. Uh, oh, there we go. So we've got Thomas Janssen, Roger Johansson, fuck, Anders Gazi, Hans Lodin, Sound of the Times, Bert Ola Nordlander, and Andreas Salamonts, and I believe he played NHL games too. Um, oh, that Sound of the Times has to go into the pole pile for Europe. And then we got the rest of our cards. All right, and then the last of the Swedish hockey card packs, we got Peter Nylander, Yuri Kachina, Yuri Kachira, sorry, Jan, yeah, Jans Omen, Henrik Nilsson, Mikael Pedersen, and Side of the Times, Lynette Svedberg. So, yeah, you guys can see uh, we got a lot of Swedish hockey cards, and that's not even including the uh, polls that we got from that one. So, yeah, we had a lot of Swedish hockey card packs. These are all of them after being opened. Uh, yeah, now we're going to move on to 2004 Quest for the Cup. I only got one pack of these, so... Uh, I guess what we'll do is actually I'm going to move over the pulls once again. We'll do like old cards, Swedish hockey, and then the modern cards. So we'll see how big that pile gets, of course, with the pulls. So we got Brian Finley. Oh, that's pretty cool. Mark Bell. Quest for the Cup card. Oh, wait. So the Brian. Wait, so is the Brian Finley then not part of the set? Why is. Okay. Mark Bell. Ryan Kessler, Danny Alfredson, and Milan uh, Hayduk. I was going to say Herchina for a second, but no. Uh, so, yeah, that's uh, – I like these cards. These Quest for the Cup cards are pretty cool. I don't know if the Brian Finley is a rookie or something like that, but just in case, I'm not going to put him under the pulls. Uh, next up, we've got three packs of 0607 Heroes and Prospects. We're going to see if we get anything decent in these. Um, really hoping that we do. Oh, these cards. Oh, I like these ones. Okay, so I'm not going to consider these as polls because they're literal. The, the prospects is the gimmick of the whole thing. we got Jamie McGinn uh, prospect. International prospect Phil Kessel. That's elite. Let's go. Ryan Perrault for Team Canada. AHL grad Johnny Bauer. That's a cool That's a cool card. I like that. And Colby Genoway for prospects. Um... Next pack up, we've got uh, Brendan Bell, HRHSL legend, Brendan Bell. That's fucking cool. I like that. Ryan Vesey, Andrew Penner, Hero Elmer Lack. Uh, it seems like the Hero cards are kind of rare. And Noah Walsh for the second pack. So, decent uh, pack. Not as good as the first, in my opinion, but that Brendan Bell was kind of cool for HRHSL region reasons. Oh, prospect Braden Coburn. That's kind of cool. Ryan uh, Ryan Hillier. Claude Giroux prospect. The Gatineau Olympics of the QMJHL. Corey Emerson prospect. And Alexander Sugloboff as a prospect. So yeah, that Claude Giroux is easily the best card we've gotten uh, if it were a legitimate rookie and not just a, hey, here's some prospect cards. Um... So yeah, next up we've got some 0910 Opeachy. Uh, the only thing I remember about these packs is that I liked them and I didn't want to put them back in the pack, but I saved them for a video like this. And uh, yeah, so we'll see if we get anything good out of these. I'm trying to open it. I love these like, I love the like waxy feel of these packs. I don't know if they're actual wax packs, but I like them. Oh yeah, okay, these packs. I really like these ones. So we've got uh, Rick DiPietro. Big shout out, actual cardboard by the way. Ryan Callahan. Oh, that's sick. Opichi Retro Mika Kiprasov. That is really cool. That is going under the polls for sure. That is a really sick Mika. Rod Brinamore. Sergei Samsonov. Stephen Weiss. Uh, oh, play free games now. Do you have what it takes to rule the U? UpperDeckU.com. I have never... Is it printed in... Do we have something printed inside the foil? Um, oh my god, we actually do have a code. Wow, that's really cool. Um, so yeah, the, apparently Upper Deck U was a thing at one point, but, yeah, these Opeachy packs, 
They're pretty cool already. I like them a lot. Oh, Gretzky kind of had a... This Gretzky kind of had a fucking accident. Must be the goddamn Blues Gretzky. Um, yeah, so we've got Yevgeny Nabokov, David Moss. Ooh, a peachy legend. Bobby Hall. That's a literal peachy legend. Holy shit, that is good. That's going in the polls, of course. Philippe Boucher, Nick Cronwall, and Danny Briere. So, another cool bunch of Opichi 0910s. Uh, and then our third Opichi uh, 0910 pack. Oh, oh yeah, I think this is a wax pack because uh, you can see kind of the, uh, you can kind of see right there. So, that's kind of cool. All right, so last pack we've got Matt Carl. Oh, marquee rookie. It's not a big name. Oh, shit. There's a shiny card behind there. Brian uh, Sal, uh, Sal, Salcedo. Salcedo. Oh, my God. That is fucking cool. Opichi shiny card. Matt D'Agostini for the Montreal Canadiens. 0910. I don't know what this is uh, called, but it's an actual... That is fucking cool. Rainbow styling and everything. You can see my ring light there. That is really cool. Matt D'Agostini. Once I get more uh, hard plastic uh, hard plastic sleeves, that's a card going in there for sure. That's a really cool one. Ilya Zubov. Daniel Girardi. <laughs> and Ole Okin. And so yeah, I can see why I remember liking 0910 now all of a sudden. <laughs> so that's really cool. And then we move on to probably what the worst pack will be, 10-11 score. Uh, and I don't say that because like the quality of the cards, but just because it's it's 10-11 score. Score was entirely, well, also this card, but um, <laughs> but because score was always massively overproduced in the early 2010s. So we got Mark Recchi, season highlights, retiring as a champion. Nick Grossman, Blake Wheeler, Arturo Nidimaki as a shark. That's a sick card. Gil Laton dresses a wild. That's fun. Uh, sudden death. Henrik Lundqvist game winning goal. Henrik Zetterberg, sorry. Uh, Henrik Lundqvist scoring a goal. That's funny. Uh, oh, there you go. Uh, yeah, game winning goal in overtime. That's going in the polls, of course. And Tim Jackman in the retro Flames jerseys. Now, actually, I believe they're current home jerseys. So, score. You know what? Not terrible. Um, I'm glad I don't get that. All right, my apologies. I just got a phone call, so that ended up interrupting the the video. Uh, but like I was saying, with the score, uh, I'm glad I don't get that for value and just for fun because that Zetterberg is kind of fun. The rest of the set, I actually don't mind the uh, the base card design. It's just overall, it's not uh, <laughs> it's not great. <laughs> you hardly argue it's good, but I don't mind it. So we got a pack of 1920 MVP, and then we've got. A pack of 21-22 Opichi, and then we are into the uh, the rest of the series packs. So I'm gonna, just gonna move the I'm just gonna move over. There we go. So, all right. So for the MVP stuff. Oh, okay. I remember this set. Okay, so we've got Nick Ritchie, Wayne Simmons, Josh Morrissey. That is a puzzle piece card. Gee, I wonder who that is. Uh, but yeah, we've got a puzzle piece card. John Carlson. And Clayton Keller. So I'm not gonna count the puzzle piece as a as a as an actual like uh pull, but there we go. So now 21 and 22 will peach. If it's anything like 0910, I'm gonna really like this set. Oh, it's even made with cardboard too. So Jeremy Lauzon, Andre Sveshnikov. Ooh, team checklist red wing. Oh my god, I like this. There we go. Flames retro. Andrew Mangiapane. I love these retro cards. Those look fucking awesome. Matt Murray. Ryan Strom. Uh, oh, shit. Nick Suzuki. That's solid. It took me a second to realize who that was. And then Kyler Yamamoto. So for the Oilers, there we go. Dude, that Nick Suzuki. Dude, you guys wonder. You guys might wonder why I like Opeachy. It's shit like that. Nick Suzuki. The retro Mangiapane. All right. So now we've got... Uh, four packs for 21, 22. All of these have eight cards a pack. So I think we just go in order. Let's just see what we got. So I don't know if there's any. Oh, I think there's a hard boy in there. So yeah, we've got Gabriel Landeskog. Uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, G uh, Justin Schultz, John Gibson. Oh, we got a 
Young Guns, I think? Jakob Silverberg. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. There we go. Young Guns, Logan Thompson. So, that is, uh, value-wise, maybe the best pull we've gotten today. That Logan Thompson's... Logan Thompson's pretty decent in, in Vegas right now. Duncan Keith. I'm just not freaking out because it's a fucking Golden Knight. Who cares about the Golden Knights? Dylan Cousins and William Carlson. So, yeah. There we go. Next up. Next pack. Uh, we've got fucking something there. We've got something. Okay. Uh, Gabriel Land Shit. Oh. Okay, it's a fucking beeping thing. Uh, shout out, uh, uh, fuck's his name one t gaming the fuck is his name again fuck i can't remember his name uh not 2bc i can't remember his name right now uh gabriel landis oh we got something shiny gabriel landis cog justin schultz john G john gibson okay dazzlers darnell nurse there we go oh, i'm sorry i'm gonna hold these a little bit closer to the camera again dazzlers darnell nurse so that's a pull duncan key dylan cousins william carlson and oh condra miller so we got one extra card there. Uh, that sucked. <laughs> so we just get a bunch of doubles there. Um, all right, next pack up. Next pack. We've got... I don't think we got a beeping thing this time. No, we don't. Joel Faraby. Jordan Stahl. Chandler Stevenson. Oh, sorry. We had a, a card that we didn't get to. We've got Seth Jones. And UD Canvas, Oliver... Bjorkstrand, so I like the UD Canvas cards. That's a solid one. That's pretty cool. We've got a Roman Yossi, Drew Doughty, and Martin Jones. So that's quite solid there. And the last pack for 21-22, Opichi, uh, Upper Deck, sorry. We've got Justin Shaw, oh God. John Gibson, Jakob Silver. Oh, we do have a Young Guns. Uh, yeah, why not? Oh, shit, there we go. Philip Gustafson. Uh, currently on the wild, this is a rookie card with the Senators, so that's another decent uh, Young Guns right there. Um, I'd say that one probably has good value, but Logan Thompson's technically a Stanley Cup champion, so I think he has the most value. Riley Smith, Chris Kreider, Anders Lee, and Mark Andre Fleury. I feel bad for him because he was in Vegas at that point. But yeah. Um, so yeah. Uh, next up, we've got uh, some packs of 21-22. These are all four cards per pack. I did not get a single. Uh, these are all from the Dollar Tree. So don't expect much value. I literally got these. They're literally a dollar. So Brendan Sutter. Oh, Okay. Uh, Joel Erickson, I think what I'll actually do is I'll just open these and then just put them in later. Dylan Larkin and Tyson Jost. I think I mean, like, I mean, like, you know, you guys know what I mean. Just to conserve a little bit of time. We've got Tom Wilson, PK Subban, Johan Larson, and Matt Nieto. Next pack up, John Marino, Tom Wilson, Connor Brown. And John Klingberg. Yeah, uh, for a dollar, again, I don't I don't mind. You don't get Young Guns. I think the Young Gun odds in these, there are Young Gun odds. They are uh, 1 in 50 packs. So there is a chance you can get a Young Gun. So for every $50, you might get a card that's worth like 3 <laughs> So, yeah. Ryan Hartman. Alexander Barkov. There you go. Kyle Connor. And Nick Paul. So... Sense fans might like that. By the way, Logan, uh, the Philip Gustafson shout out, uh, Lucas C and Oakley, uh, Yanni Kokkinen, Radic Foxa, Kevin Fiala and Kyler Yamamoto yet again. Um, Owen Tippett now with the Flyers, uh, Bowen Byram. Yeah. Uh, Johan Larson and Matt Nieto again. Last pack of 21-22, we've got Sam Steele, Dante Fabro, uh, Aaron Ekblad, and uh, Andre Burkowski. I believe still with the still with the Avs. So there we go. We got a decent amount of cards just for 21-22. Uh, 
And now we're on to 2223. So what I'm going to do, boys, is, uh, as you can you can tell, again, there's two slimmer. We're going to open the uh, slim packs first. Why not? Uh, so, yeah. These ones. I actually really like the set of 2223. I don't think they've revealed the look of 2324 yet, but um, I'm sure they will sometime soon. By the way, I'm just going to tilt the, the camera. There we go. Just a little bit. So we got Tristan Jari. Uh, Vitek Vanacek, I believe now with the Devils, Troy Terry, and Adam Pellick, second of the four card packs, we've got Braden Point, uh, Miro Haskinen, Kyle Ocpozo, and Kyle Connor. And now we're going to get into the uh, two eight card packs, which you can get Young Guns, the odds on Young Guns, and these are very... Favorable, they're one and four, so uh, there's a chance we get a decent card here. Uh, no beeping thing, so we got a Lucas Raymond, Vasily Podkolzin, Philip Kershev. Oh, oh, cool rookie retrospective, Michael Bunting. So that's another, so that is a poll. Um, not a fan of Michael Bunting, but that's kind of cool. Uh, UC Saros. Zach Wierenski, Andrew Mangiapane, and Damon Severinsen, now with the Blue Jackets. So there's that. Next up for Series 1. Uh, oh, shit. Uh, no beeping thing either. We got Tyler Myers, Ryan Hartman, David Posternock, Dylan Strom. Oh, Defense Mechanism. Seth Jones, that's a pretty cool looking card. Just sucks that it's of a very bad defenseman, but actual pull isn't too bad. Tanner Pearson, now with Montreal. Uh, Jujar Kara and Marty Natchez. So, fun card there. Just a second, because there's a, the pile of inserts have has fallen over, so i got to take care of that. Just give me a second real quick, boys. All right, we are back, and uh, yeah, I just cleaned them up a little bit now. So we've got just the packs, the four card packs of 22, 23 left. I got all of these at one time from the Dollar Tree last time we went. I believe last time we went, so I'm not probably going to get any pulls, but let's just see what base cards we got. We got Capo Caco, Dawson Mercer, John of the Marcheseau, Patrick Hornquist, who is uh, unfortunately now retired. We've got... Austin Watson, Robert Thomas, Jordan Stahl, and Brock Besser. Actually, I'm going to move the camera over just a little bit, just because it does seem like I'm leaning more towards that way. There we go. So, Matt Waugh, me Mikael Backlund, Nathan McKinnon, Michael Rasmussen, Scott Lawton, Dyson Mayo, big fan of Dyson Mayo, Jack Hughes, and Elias Lindholm. Zem God, Zemgus Gergensons, uh, Caleb Jones, Tyler Bertuzzi, Nick Bonino. Nick Suzuki, there we go. Still wearing the A, actually. That's fun. Charlie McAvoy. Uh, Sebastian Ajo, weird he's in the Hurricanes jersey, and another Jordan Stahl. Um, Jacob McCabeth, Mikael Granlin, Brock Besser, and Tyler Bertuzzi. Patty Kane, Jakob Slavin, JJ Moser, Yanis Moser actually, and Sam Reinhardt. On to the last two packs, and then we are Completely done, boyos. We've got Tyler Sagan, Tavo Teravainen, Elias Lindholm, and Eric Robinson. And then the last pack, we've got Travis Boyd, Zach Hyman, Simeon Varlamov, and Matt Dumba. What a way to, to end this off. So all the Series 1 cards and all the Series 2 cards will go right on top. Oh, fuck. Alright, apologies, we had some technical difficulties real quick. Uh, 
<laughs> but yeah, so we are back. Like I said, uh, the Series 1 cards, all the Series 2 cards going on top. Uh, actually, I'm going to take the camera off the tripod this time. There we go. So you guys can see now all of the cards. Of course, these are the old school cards, the Swedish cards, the Poles, uh, the regular, uh, the modern day cards, and then the Poles. I'm actually going to show off the Poles one more time. So we'll start with the Swedish ones. We've got a bunch of Sign of the Times, some World junior uh, championships we got some day in the lifes um a lot of sign of the times i don't know why they gave me this many sign of the times if these are like it's only pull uh the trade card that's probably like top three favorite <laughs> pulls of the day uh or pulls of the last four years technically uh that thing as well in there don't know why that was there um and then yeah so the defense mechanisms uh the young guns were pretty cool the young ones are pretty cool. Oh, <laughs> oh! I've been off my computer for so long, and I haven't moved the mouse, so the screen just blacked out. <laughs> oh, that's fun. All right, but yeah, the uh, the two young guns, uh, the Mangiapane, the retros. I loved the retros. The Mad Dagestini was solid. Uh, the Opichi pulls as a whole were great, and then of course the the Opichi rookies, the Ralph Macchio, Gaetan Boucher, Marv Albert. Um, wherever Jim Belushi was, James Belushi, sorry, um, yeah, and then the 91 Penguins, the top prospects, the Lindros might be my favorite pull of the day, actually, uh, and then the rest, all there, so, yeah, decent, decent amount of pulls from today's, uh, accessuation, and yeah, I think that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, favorite channel, those includes, but it's not limited to YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Parallels. My name is Harris. We're going to Puff Club, the Hitchy Club, Sub Up, D Nation. If you remember the Lots Club, the Orbit of Cost of Shapes, and if it is, it's most great. Appreciate it. Link description. <sighs> Link description on the Amazon, Mr. The PO Box, PayPal, Letterbox, Spinner Account, the Twitch, and the Discord, and the Stream Labs are all down there as well. Thank you guys again so much for watching. My name is Harris, and I. I'm out. Love you guys. I don't know what remember, no matter, no matter how bad we are, like last year, how good we are, like this year. Go Habs, go, baby. Thank you guys again so much for watching. My name's Harris, and I am out. Love you guys. See you guys. Bye, guys. 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 Bye.